Hello everybody, welcome to another installment of the OOTP 22 Perfect Team series I've been doing featuring my team, the Big Polly's Bombers. It's part 21 on 620-2021. Happy Father's Day to all. As we rejoin you this Sunday, we have 16,445 points in the Perfect Point Bank. We're in Iron League 193, day 187. So we will open things up. OOTP Go now available. Although I, I, I downloaded it from my iPhone and then when I uh, opened up the game here on the computer it asked me for my ID and password. So maybe you'll have to jigger around with that as uh, things progress. But it was no problem. I, I, I know my uh, ID and password for Perfect Team by heart, so it's like it wasn't like it was a big deal. We went 86 and 76 this season. Let's see if that was good for a playoff. And no, we just missed the playoff by one measly game. Oh. 16,445 points, so we're going to open up 16 more packs right now. With my cat, Harry. On my left as I am petting him. Are you sure you want to get 16 packs for 16,000 points? Yes. So we'll go ahead and do that. We always get down to business on this show. Long before that Tiesto song, let's get down, let's get down to business. Yeah. I did that pretty well, didn't I? All right. So let's just open up the cards. See what we have. All right. Chris Nabholtz, I remember him. Nearly had, I think he had a no-hitter against somebody. I think it was against the Dodgers in the early 90s and he lost it in extras. So let's open up another pack. See how many gold and diamond and maybe a perfecto will come our way. Well, let's see. We have one, two more bronzes. Hope you've all been enjoying the HTBL series I started up this week. Couldn't do... A true hometown league with that because I think the New York team would dominate so I just did it by uh, franchises I will I will not note the the player here in the top row in the center I'm just gonna leave that alone one more bronze A diamond. There we go. Mookie Betts. Right fielder to Dodgers. A 96. Not a bad card, too. We'll open up another pack. And it's Kenta Maeda, Silver, leading the way in that charge. A couple of bronzes, three bronzes, including Greg Goosen of the Seattle Pilots, which is kind of interesting. Because right now I'm reading Ball 4 again by Jim Bouton. And Goosen's mentioned quite frequently in that book. The old Seattle Pilots only lasted one year and moved to Milwaukee. And Boughton, before the season ended, had moved to Houston on a trade. One bronze that time, Hobie Landreth of the Giants. A silver, that's good. And two more bronzes. Oh, thank you. 
Another gold. One bronze, and that's it. Seven packs left. Good boy, buddy. Good boy. I was talking to my cat. <laughs> Two more bronzes. Six to go. And Badu of Detroit leading the way on that pack. A 63. And on that, we only got Adam Duvall from that Miami. Thinking it's Miami. Next pack. Another diamond. Mo Vaughn. Put Mo in and forget. Which was an old code from, I think, Madden 96. Henry Rodriguez of the Expos. Another good pickup. So we got four bronze or hires in that and one diamond. No, I'm, I'm not kidding. That was a code in Matt. Harry's hearing the fireworks in my earphones and he's going crazy. So that was one, two more bronzes. We're down to two or three more packs. And then we might get some on the collections. One more pack to open as we pick up two more bronze. Go for the gold. Go for a perfecto here. Another diamond. Oh. This guy you might have heard of, Lou Gehrig. I had Lou Gehrig in Perfect Team 21. Harry's hearing all the fireworks and he's departing me. And that'll do it for this week. And now we just got to see where everything will wind up. Ask I to set up team, which it has done. So that's going to lead to managing cards. First I need to check the collections. Uh, progress on the collection missions. And... Oh yeah! Um, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more co collections to submit. And we will do so right now. This is the Paul Goldschmidt Bronze mission that I am submitting. Okay. Arizona 15, I could submit that. And we'll have some more uh, card packs to go through. I uh, also completed the Tim Salmon Bronze Lock, which we will open. You got to open it to submit it, which I don't know why that is. I don't know. I just don't give you credit for it. And we have one, two, three, four, five packs, at least five. Yes, five packs that uh, we are like one card away from. Uh, also completed the Detroit 15 pack, so we open that and submit it. So as Luke Brown would say, there is gold in the hills when it comes to collections. And we did pretty good uh, without collections because we picked up three more diamonds, including a Lou Gehrig. Miami 15 also completed. That will be submitted. So we have another, and then we got one more after this, and we got six more packs to open. 
New York N15, which is the Mets, of course. And we submit that. So we're going to have a gold rush out of this because I think six of the, uh, five of these packs are going to be golds, at least. And here we go. Well, one's a regular. It's one's going to be a bronze. Might get something out of it. You never know. Alright, next pack. This is also a normal pack. I know we have some gold packs coming. One, two, three more bronzes. Okay. Here, okay, the rest of these will be golds. So we had four golds. And here's the gold card. Paul Fry. Left-hander reliever of the Orioles. Orioles are probably the worst team in the American League right now. Some bad teams in the National League, too. So we picked up... Who did we pick up? We picked up Blake, Blake Trennan... We're trining a uh, reliever from the Dodgers, so our bullpen will get stronger out of this. Chad Green, another reliever. Next pack, last pack. And that's another uh, starter and a silver and two bronzes. So we came out of that one pretty good. So now we can manage. We're now at the point where we have all gold on my team. And we have one, two, three, six, nine diamonds. So that's not too bad. Now, we check the collection missions again. And three more missions have been completed. Okay. We might be here a while at this rate, folks. We'll submit that. That'll be another gold card. So we've completed a few missions here. And Philadelphia 15, Colorado 15 is now complete. So we'll put stamps on that and send it. I haven't decided what my title of this is going to be. I'm thinking of uh, a couple of things. But if you're watching this video, you know I've already come up with a title, so I don't know what the use is of all of that. Kansas City 15 completed. And let's check out the latest round. Hang on, folks. Okay, so that's Jordan Alvarez that we picked up. Where's the fireworks? Did the fireworks go off and I miss it? And we pick up Glaber Torres of the Yankees.
Carlos Rodon. And that's some more packs. Now, we should look at collections again and see if I picked up anybody else. This has been quite a haul today, really. Yep, I picked up three more. <laughs> oh, this is good. So we will submit three more. We'll get a standard pack out of name game Carlos. And we will get something for Los Angeles 15. Submit. <laughs> this is not bad, really. And what else did we score on this time? We got Milwaukee 15. So we will submit that. And we have three more packs to open. Well, I have to open up Milwaukee 15 first. I thought I had already had. Uh, submit that and get another gold pack. All right, so we open up three more packs here. The rate we're going, I might get this done by the time the Biden administration ends. So there's one. There's my standard. I got one bronze out of that. Another Rodon. We'll take it. Might be worth it something on another collection. And our gold was, yeah, Carlos Rodon again. All fry again. So the hits just keep on coming. And we'll take the duplications. We'll take them to the bank. Uh, so <laughs> I'm almost frightened to ask if I have an, uh, completed any <laughs> completed two more. <laughs> Jimmy Roll, uh, Rollins bronze lock. So I submit that. And let's see, what was the other? Texas 15. <laughs> So this is what happens. This just never ends. It's a collection bonanza. So we'll open up two more packs. <laughs> See what we do. I might actually one day get to auction off some of these. But right now it's just collection, collection, collection. Which is good and it's bad at the same time because I was trying to keep this one short. The gold is Chad Green. Uh, I was watching The Godfather yesterday. It was on the Paramount channel, not Paramount Plus. And you notice when so Sonny Corleone gets shot, he's, he's going to the to the drive-thru and there's mobsters waiting for him and gonna kinda make human Swiss cheese out of them. Uh, uh, Khan is, watch is listening to the call of Russ Hossett, uh, listening to Russ Hodges call the giant, uh, giant Dodger playoff game at 51. Uh, I recognize, you know, Russ, Russ Hodges, Russ Hodges is, I can't say it, the voice of Russ Hodges in it. And, you know, don't uh, you don't hear the moment where Russ Hodges goes nuts and says the Giants win the pennant, but you could hear him doing play by play. Okay, now did I score any more collection missions? One more. <laughs> Pittsburgh fifteen, which will get me another gold back. Okay, well, this isn't too bad, really. What's that game they play on the Price is Right, where they have all, have all these turns? One away, they're trying to win a car, and if you get at least one right, you can keep going. 
that's kind of where I am with all of this. Okay, now, thank you very much for the Derek Dietrich card. Marlins, second baseman, 2016. Did I get another collection mission? One more. <laughs> LA Angels, 15. Okay, let's just keep going. This is uh, beyond rich. So, let's open up another pack. <laughs> it's, it's getting silly. Sonny Gray of the Cincinnati Reds. Used to play for Oakland. And a diamond, Matt Kemp of the Dodgers. Okay, now... <laughs> Any more collection missions? <laughs> One more! <laughs> oh, I'm giggling like crazy. It's like, um, speaking of game shows, the guy who won Michael Larson on Press Your Luck, and he won all that money. Well, back in 1985, they didn't give away a lot of money on game shows. So he figured out how the Press Your Luck board worked, and he walked away with something like $115,000. Uh, which, like I said, for a game show in 85 is big money. Uh, and he kept pressing his luck, and he kept doing the spins, and he couldn't be stopped. Uh, so I, I think CV, the, the show went so long, CBS made two episodes of it. Uh, a two-parter, which for ra game shows is very rare. So another gold pack. This is an embarrassment of riches. We got two golds. Okay. I'm almost afraid to ask again. Did I get another collection mission reward? And the answer is no. Finally, we are done with <laughs> collection missions. What a run this was. So uh, now we will manage the team. And now we have one, two, three. How many? We still have three, six, ten uh, diamond members on my team. So the quality of my team should go way up with the with this card haul that I just had. Now we manage the cards. I imagine it's going to take a while to sell uh, things that are not in the mission. So we have a lot of inactives and reserves to go through. Actually, not that many because it's not scrolling. So we will just sell. Ozzy Vit. Go 2884 on Ozzy. I think we have seen him before. I think we might even see him again. Uh, Sammy Vick, 1919. Uh, I think we had him before. We'll just go 100, 300 on that. And you don't want to sell players on your active roster. Faye Thornberry of the 52 Red Sox. We'll go 28. We'll double the uh, winning bid. I'm just making up that rule right now. 28.98. So this collection thing is a thing. Dan Songer shouldn't be going for 126, but he is. So I'll go 60.250 on him. And not automatically sell them. Henry Rodriguez, not in any collection missions, so he will go 28110. And we sell him. We don't want to give away Sung Wan Oh, our closer, even though that's worth 14,000. Just for giggles, let me just see what he's at. Four, yeah, he's still at 14,000 points. Ray Murray. Murray is of the 53 A's, and he's going to go up 31, 124.
Okay, another player on the reserve is Doc Mill. He's going 697, which is for a silver almost obscene. So we'll go 350, 1400. We'll get him back if nobody wants him. Jesse Lewis going for a good price on uh, 11.42 on him, and we won't sell him back. Keep him on ice. Lou Gehrig is going for forty thousand. I don't know if that would be worth it. Uh, Hank Lieber. 11, 12, 2,800, and I'll sell them for a thou if no bid is placed. Hobie Landreth, 2,894. Uh, we won't mention this name of this player, uh, but we're going to get rid of him. <laughs> Take a good long look before I, I do something with him here. Because you'll probably see him again. Uh, I won't mention that name. <laughs> and we'll do cop at 12 and 48. Another reserve we'll get rid of is Josephson of the Chicago White Sox. Yeah, that is the White Sox logo they had back in the late 60s. A White Sox and a red player. Uh, let's see, 52, we'll go, we'll go 28 and put them up at 104. Dalton Jones, 28, and 48, we'll go 82, and we'll sell them. Other inactive is Tom Hutton. Not the same Tom Hutton who does commentary for the Miami Marlins and maybe a few other teams. I'm thinking. I don't know. 1040 and we'll sell them at 5 if no one's interested. I'm tempted to sell Gehrig uh, with that $40,000 uh, 40000 not dollar but point uh, price tag he has. Hmm. Well you know what? I'm not selling them for 4 and I'm going to make this a 6 hour bid 20,000, 80,000. See if we score on this. If I score on this, we're going to have a much longer episode for you next week. Submit. And let's see here. Greg Goosen, who I was mentioning before, 28,106. And almost done, folks. Uh, Florence is a 9 and a 36. Actually, you should go back to 24 hours. I think I put that uh, goosen up for 6 hours, too. Oh, well. Oh, well. You're going to make mistakes. And Claude Elliott, 9, 36. Sell it 5. I'm selling no more. I'm just going to sell Gary because I think 40000 is a sellable price. Uh, Bob Barton. Now he's a guy who could go. 178 We'll go 700 And we'll keep him around if nobody bites. And our last item up for bids is Glenn Adams. 47 to 200 and we'll sell them for 25 if nobody's interested. Well, I wasn't expecting the episode to go this long. But as you saw, we had collection mission after collection mission after collection mission. And sometimes that's the way it goes. 
If some things sell well, we might be having another very long episode again next Sunday. This has been Big Polly coming to you, wishing you well, a happy Father's Day to all. Godspeed and God bless. We'll do it all again soon, and bye-bye for now, everybody. Everybody. Everybody, everybody. Great song from the 90s. Okay, bye-bye.